Hey guys, it's Jag here from Jag Aquatics and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we will be unboxing these new lights that I got. They are nano lights from LED Star. They were released in Australia a few months back and I really wanted to try them and see how they perform compared to some other brands. A few of the key features of these lights are they are app controllable and it's a WRGB lights and the best part is that they are priced really well in Australia they only come at $139.95 so in this video what we will do is we will go through the complete unboxing session and after that I will install it on one of our water box nano tanks and uh, we will also go through the app to see the uh, how the app performs so yeah without any further delays let's jump behind the camera and start the unboxing so before we jump into the unboxing Part of the video let's quickly go through the features of this light so this is wrgb 22 watt wrgb stands for white red green and blue leds that are part of this uh, whole unit and uh, then this light is fully app controlled it comes with ios and android apps that you can download uh, it also has a sunrise and sunset features what that means is that there's an inbuilt timer and also app is really cool i like the app because there you can uh, set different settings like for green color red or a bucket flying rear tank or a paludarium but also you can do a pro settings where you can exactly set how the spectrum should look at different times also it is waterproof ip68 it comes with two-year manufacturer warranty and also it is perfect for 40 centimeter or below tanks so what you can see with this packaging it's a minimalistic looking packaging not fancy colors on the box at all but what they have done is they have labeled it nicely it's a nano lights and also they show um, there's a qr code which you can scan to get the app and clearly show the spectrum of the light at the same time they are uh, the label that is there shows the content and at the bottom they have the light specs plus the color of the light so in this case we're gonna be unboxing the gray color lights so it's clearly shown there so next we will be unboxing these lights and um, as you can see here uh, inside the box these lights are really nicely packed and also it comes with a card which basically shows you all the screenshots of the app and also how you can install it uh, it's not a detailed information but good enough to get an idea uh, so this light comes with a small pouch which contains all the accessories so uh, what you will see here is it has a clamp allen key three screws and a couple of o-rings so these parts are really necessary so make sure do you don't lose any while unpacking them uh, so you can see here the clamp that will hold the light on the side of the tank and uh, you know a few other small parts bit and pieces and also do make sure i'm just making sure here that i'm not missing any part because if you lose those one of those screws it, there's no uh, there's no extras in there so make sure that you don't lose them uh, next we have a bluetooth controller now uh, let's start do mention that the their bluetooth controller is really good and it can it can handle a distance of 30 meter i haven't tested it but um, I did test it by going outside my house and I can still control the lights and it, it connects really fast so it's quite reliable from what I used. Uh, next you can see the other gray lights so they do come in two different two other colors which is uh, rose gold and champagne. Um, I like that because these lights uh, do have more color choice there are some other brands they don't have any extra color choice so which is a good thing also uh, when you attach the vertical rod which i'm doing it here make sure that you don't cut by mistake the wire or the wire is uh, doesn't come in between those two rods and uh, yeah just attach it and uh, after some time i will show how to install the clamp on the lights uh, also they do come with the australian power plugs and uh, and power cord so this stock is from a genuine Australian distributor so do make sure uh, if you want a warranty uh, of one year it uh, you are supporting the Australian retailers or Australian distributors as we carry the gen stock you can see there is a power cable and the adapter uh, that's part 
part of all the things in the box. Um, so just quickly go through it again. You have an adapter, you have a power cable, you have a clamp, one Allen key, couple of O-rings which will hold the light, and um, there are three little screws which will be used uh, to attach the clamp to the light, uh, a manual card, and uh, Bluetooth controller, and the light. So after this, what we're gonna do, we will be installing the clamp uh, on the lights and using those little screws that came with it. So next I will be attaching the clamp to the lights and uh, this clamp have a have two little screws that will hold the clamp to the aquarium wall and the third screw is given for holding the clamp and the light together. Uh, so make sure that all three screws are attached because uh, they are important for light to be stable and nicely installed on the tank. The easiest way I found to attach these screws is use the Allen key and the screw together, hold it with the Allen key and then you can tighten it to the clamp really easy like I'm doing it here. So all the three screws are done now. So next I will install those two red um, o-rings that that came with the light so we will install them on the vertical section of the light which will define the height of the light so where um, where it will sit uh, over the clamp so first o-ring will be installed first and after that i will install the clamp and then the second o-ring Yeah, we have installed the first o-ring and make sure again the open part of the clamp is at the bottom so that's what i'm doing pass through the wire through the clamp and uh, if you if you've uh, missed or changed the direction of the clamp you have to redo it all again i have to do it once again so that's why i make sure that the positioning of the clamp is correct and once you install the clamp then uh, you can use the third screw here to tighten the clamp to the vertical section of the light which makes it really secure and it will not move and after that you can use uh, another o-ring to place below the clamp so that's how the um, typical installation works with other brands that have a similar style of light but let star did provide extra screw there which can be utilized uh, to hold the clamp and light together next you can see here is i'm attaching the bluetooth controller to the light and after that we will attach the power cable uh, to the bluetooth co bluetooth connector so here next is the power cable and then we are pretty much ready to switch on these lights So power cable is all attached, everything is ready to go and now we will install these lights on our water box tank. So what you can see here is I'm using a brand new water box aquarium that I will be setting up uh, using these new lights. I am going to create a new aquascape and video will be shared on my channel. Uh, so what you can see here is I am installing those grey nano lights that we just assembled. I'm just putting the clamp area on the edge of the edge of the aquarium one of the walls and it will still hold there uh, but i'm just gonna get a allen key and tighten it uh, so it's pretty easy straightforward using those two screws and it has a little bit of uh, plastic padding to it and just uh, secure it nice and tight uh, don't super tight it because uh, you know that's always recommended uh, as long as it's firm it will hold this place really easy and it's really easy to assemble it on your tank like you can see it here lights are installed and after this what we're gonna do is uh, we'll be we'll be searching the LED star app and installing it so you can see here that I have opened the app search on my phone I'm using iPhone uh, so depending on your phone the interface might look a little different but you search for AQ star that's the easiest way I find to find the app and uh, double click on the side button if you're using iPhone and you can install the app so the installation is started once you install open the app 
it will ask for username and password but because you are using it for the first time you will have to register uh, while registering you have to enter an uh, email id and have to press verification code once verification code is pressed uh, you will get a confirmation and uh, you will get a code and you have to enter that code to log into the app it will take some time uh, for the email to come through so be patient there i think it for me it took three or four minutes for the email to come in once that is done and you're logged in you will um, you will see next screen where the arrow is so this is your logged in and to add a new device you have to press on this uh, plus sign and that will uh, basically give you a notification that your bluetooth is on so you can see here is i can pretty much straight away pick up this nano device or the nano lights and after that the nano light will be shown there on clicking on the icon you will come up with the set of icons so what these icons are like you can see i am on a fully switched on uh, position and the light will change and once now i'm on a green and the light will change in the same way you have different colors so i'm just going through different colors uh, so basically you can see the spectrum change according to what you press like bucket of Henry, I had a totally purple kind of look uh, so it's it's pretty easy to play with this light and now what i will show how to set up the sunset and sunrise so <clears throat> that's what uh, the screen looks like here once you set up on a quick setup and here you can uh, you can quickly press on the sunrise and what i'm doing here is selecting the time when the sunrise should happen and uh, like for example here i want it to happen eight o'clock in the morning and after that you can set up a sunset uh, for example it can be four o'clock or five o'clock in the evening depending on whether you want eight hours or ten hours uh, you'd like to run and and it's pretty straightforward you set that up and after that you press on the save button so as soon as you press on the save button it will give you an option to enter the custom name so once you do that um, it will basically create a new icon on the main page where you have all the other icons like it's created here so to activate it just press on that on that icon and it's basically activated now in this next screen what i'm going to show you is the professional setting so once you're in professional you can really control the light more so for example i want to set up my time from eight o'clock in the evening till four o'clock in the morning i do run my tanks especially my grow tanks at that time because um, it's an off peak time uh, you know you can save on your electricity and i don't want to see those tanks all the time so when i'm home you know i can see it from eight to ten o'clock so but to set that up there's no straight option with the quick setup you have to go to the professional setup where you can set set up multiple slots like you can see i am setting up in the evening to the morning for the next day uh, so i did find it find it little hard in the start because i didn't know that professional setting can do that uh, but uh, led star help and i think this video will be really helpful for those who really want to do their own setup and again you can create a new icon and once you click that it's ready to uh, ready to go so just to revisit the features again it's a wrgb 22 watt light it's fully app controlled and you've seen the app is really solid good bluetooth uh, no issues with the app and uh, it has a sunrise and sunset feature you can set the switch on and switch off time it is ip68 standard waterproof it, literally it can go under the water uh, for some time and it will be safe it has a two years manufacturer warranty um, australian stock is all there and available in australia and it's also available on on our website it's perfect for 40 centimeter or below tanks so it's a beautiful looking sleek different colors available in this light so if you are looking for a nano light at a good price and which looks sleek i would say this is one of the best options available in the market the next question is where can you buy this light this is available on our online retail store viraquatics.com.au where you can go and buy these lights i have added uh, both the links in the description so you can get a gray color or you can get a rose gold color which is also a beautiful color so they are available in two colors i hope this video was really helpful if you want to choose your next next nano light for your aquarium and if you have any questions please drop it in the comment section and i will reply as soon as possible thanks guys for watching this video and i will see you in the next video take care